It is to be love. I'm Tony from Rome, and this is Tronatales.com Fact of the Day. Ergen, Bergen, Bergen, Bergen. Translated, that means what are crennels? What are crennels? That's where I go to get my fried chicken. At the crennels. Crennels? What are you trying to say, love? Do you mean kernels? That's what I said. At the kernels. Was that like Colonel Caesar's Coliseum fried chicken, love? Exactly. Colonel Caesar's. Down by the Coliseum, right next to Nuncio's. That's my cousin's place. So I go there on Saturdays to get my chicken in a bucket. You know, chicken in a bucket. And then at lunchtime, sometimes I go down there and I get my two piece. You either get the white meat or you get the dark meat. And then they give you your two sides. They give you the mac and the cheese or they give you the cabbage. I like the cabbage stuff. The cabbage stuff. The, the, the coleslaw. And then I get my, my mashing gravy and they give you a biscuit and you put some butter on it. Man, it's, it's good. I'm telling you, it's good. And then, and then that's the spot by the Coliseum. Down at the Crenels. Oh, I think you mean a crenellated wall. <laughs> A crenellated wall. I can tell you about a crenellated wall. Crenellated wall. So what you do is you get your mason. And you get your handful of lowly serfs. And you get them to go get some rocks and some blocks and some muddy stuff to stick in between them. So they stick together and then you make, you make a row. And you make another row on top of that row and another row on top of that row. Row, row, row your belt. Oh, get on with it! And you build this row all the way around the castle and the, the wall. It's a wall, and you bring and you keep going row, 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 and then you got a wall, and then you make sure you make it wide enough so people can walk on it. And then so you, your knights and your man at arms and the other soldier type fellas, then they can walk on this wall. And you build another skinny or a half wall, right? So that protects them from when the other soldiers from the, across the ocean they come and they want to they want to steal your gold and whatnot. And, and they're going to siege the castle. And so they got this little half wall, right? You got this little half wall. And then your soldiers, they come up. And they jump up. And they twang their, their, their arrows. They shoot their arrows from their bows at the other guys that are storming the castle. And, and, and they did this for a long time. And then, but then they used to get shot back. And be like, ah, oh, you know, ah. Oh, and then you got an arrow stuck inside you. And, you know, you fall down and it hurts and stuff. And you can't shoot arrows back at it anymore. So then they got smarter. They got smarter what they did. And here's the important part. Here's what they did. They got some blocks. And they staggered them. One here, one here, one here, one here. And and they left a space in between. Oh, Corporal Kane got to go to the loo. Oh, can't wait on this bloke. Who had me waiting all day the way he mutters on and on. Ain't no fun up here pulling on night guard duty. Well, you'll get me later, and it'll be amusing. What's really amusing is down on the ground down there is Corporal Kane. Didn't know they was calling for rain. Oh, <laughs> you know, it's sort of like the space in the donut. It's like the donut hole, but it's square. Anyway, and then you could shoot your arrows through the hole, and you'd stick it in their chest, and they'd shoot their arrows back, and, and you'd, you'd quick duck next to the, the block that's there. And, and the block that's next to the... The square donut hole, that's known as a Merlon. No, I don't mean Merlon the Magnificent. You heard of Merlon the Magnificent, haven't you? None you. You remember Merlon, don't you? See, si. I think I remember the Safala. He like it either the chicken or massage. See. Si. Nunzio. See, I remember this fella. He is scares of me. Oi! Couple game! I've got to go to the loo! All night guard duty means all night, Boris. What you mean you got to go to the loo? 
I gotta go, yes, yes, like the French. Yes, yes. What in the bloody hell does that mean, Boris? Yes, yes. Translated into French is we we we. Oh, wee wee. I have to go wee wee too. Henry VIII, Tower of London, dinner party. Oh, who could that be? I hope it's the seams. Oh, look, it's the seamstress. Come in, dear. We're having a party for my wife. You've met my wife, Anne, Anne Bolin. Dear, I've decided to have the seamstress come and measure you for a cough, 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 for a dress. For your birthday, I'm having her make you a dress, and she needs some measurements, some special measurements. Yes, dear, use your tape measure and whatnot, and get your measurements. It's going to be such a lovely dress. Yes. Yes, you'll need the height and the, the width and the depth for the for, <laughs> for the dress. And then she's going to need her special tools to measure and to seamstress up the dress. Oh, get on with it. No, wait. Don't get on with it. Get off with it. More, 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 more. Happy birthday, Anne. More. Anne, dear. I've got to know. How do you like your new dress? Whoa! 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 <laughs>